As the 2016 season began, the odds were stacked against the Patriots when the immortal Tom Brady missed the first four games because of his deflategate suspension. How you doing? How are you, buddy? Trying to, to figure out who's going to play? Yeah, I'm so are we. <laughs> I can't. Remember you might need zero. a program with some of those numbers. It looks a little wild here in warm-ups. He'll be fine, I think. He'll yeah. Fine. yeah, he will. But in number 12's absence, Bill Belichick led the Patriots to a 3-1 and one record with a pair of backups under center. You got the third quarterback on your roster, running the bootleg on the keeper. And boy, is this place filling it for the kid. What a run. Patriots down to the third quarterback. Doesn't matter, the train keeps rolling. In week five, Brady returned with a vengeance. Over the next 12 games, he threw 28 touchdowns and only two interceptions. The best ratio in NFL history. Gronkowski catching stride past the five. Touchdown, Patriots. And the sheer domination continues. What a throw by Tom. Unbelievable throw. Great, better catch. What made it really impressive was that Brady accomplished it without throwing to a single Pro Bowl receiver. Rob Gronkowski missed half the year with injuries. Julian Edelman was a former quarterback drafted in the seventh round as a wideout. And Chris Hogan was a college lacrosse player with his fifth team. New England's defense isn't loaded with star power either. But under coordinator Matt Patricia, the unit allowed the fewest points in the lead. During the Patriots' seven-game win streak to close out the regular season, New England held opponents to under 13 points per game. How about this defense? They're having fun. They're making plays. Patricia and Belichick got them playing exactly the way they wanted to play. In the playoffs, the Patriots relied heavily on their unknowns. In the divisional round, Deion Lewis, a former third-string running back for the Eagles, scored three times to take down the Texans. Outrunning the Texans down the right side. Goodbye! Deion Lewis takes it to the house! Way to go, D. Lou! Hey, D. Lou, get some oxygen. Go, baby! Get some oxygen, Bubs. In the AFC Championship, Chris Hogan scored twice and racked up 180 yards receiving, the most by any Patriot in a playoff game in team history. Thanks to a roster of unheralded players who thrived under the direction of Belichick, New England overcame every challenge en route to its record ninth Super Bowl appearance.